hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel in today's video we're going to be recreating this instagram story interaction which i created using variants and components so we're going to be prototyping these interactions and i will also show you how you can add videos to your designs just like this so let's get right into it we're going to start off by creating the progress bar indicator for our instagram story so i'll be using a rectangle for that i'm going to change the width to 110 and the height to up then i'm going to change the corner radius to 24 then i'm going to select this rectangle and press command d to make a duplicate of it so once i've done that i'm going to select the rectangle on top and rename it to top this is going to be the progress bar that will be at the top then i will select the one under and i'm going to call it bottom then i'll select our bottom rectangle and then reduce the opacity of its fill color to 16 percent just the bottom rectangle you will notice that the color of the bottom rectangle has faded a little compared to the top one so i'm just going to take it back to remain the way it was then the next thing i'm going to do now is to highlight the both of them and then head over to our component section and select create component i'm going to head back to my component section again and click on add variant i'm also going to add another variant here so this is it this is our default right so for this variant to i'm going to rename it to field then this third variant i'm going to rename the property to steal then i'm going to come back to this steel variant and then open it up and then select the top bar of this one of the steel variant and then head over to its suite and just reduce the width to zero then i'm also going to come to our default and then expand it select the top rectangle or the progress bar and then also reduce it to zero i'll head over to the prototype section i'm going to select our default progress bar which is this one and then link it to the field progress bar so once i've done that i'll set it to an after delay of one meter per second and i'll set the animation to smart animate of is in and out and then i'll set the duration to eight thousand meter per second i'm going to come to this two bar section and i'll select rectangle and then change the width to 393 and the height to 852 so select the video option here and then select choose video i'll select this one so as you can see our video is playing and working your video duration has to be the same as your progress bar indicator if you select this after delay you find out that the duration is 8000 meter per seconds 8000 meter per seconds equals 8 seconds my video as you can see is 8 seconds and i'm going to come to this prototype section and make sure it's in autoplay and that the loop 
feature is also activated i'll be bringing in two more videos since we have three stories i'm going to select this one and make a duplicate select and make a duplicate then i'm going to select the second one come to this right side and then select video and click on choose video then i'm going to select this one which is also eight seconds i'm also going to select this one choose another video and select this one which is also eight seconds then i'm going to bring in my mobile frame i'm going to be using 390 by 844 so i'm going to bring in this one then i'll bring in my already designed elements add them here and then i'll rename this to story one i'm going to bring in our progress bar for our first insta story i'll be using the default and then i'm going to paste it here i'm also going to copy the steel progress bar indicator this is our default bar indicator so this is going to be the first then i'll bring in our steady it's going to be the second then i also make another duplicate of this steady i'm going to align everything this is the default progress bar this is the steel progress bar and this is the steel progress bar for the first story then i'm going to make another duplicate so this is our story to right i'm going to change this video for the progress bar we're going to switch this to field we're going to switch this to default we're going to leave this one as still then i'm going to make another duplicate of this third story and then i'll bring in the video then for this last story we're going to leave this first progress bar as field then we're going to set this one as field again we're going to set this one as default on this first screen as you can see there's no field progress bar here because this is the first story then this second one is supposed that we've already seen this first story hence this field progress bar on this story and then this third one we have two progress bars field which are the story one and the story two that's the essence of using three different variants so i'm just going to bring in my already designed instagram profile i'm going to head over to my prototype section but before that i would like to make a duplicate of this profile and then change it from linear to solid this particular profile screen indicates that the story has already been watched that's why i'm changing it to gray i'm going to head over to the prototype section i'm going to select the story and then link it to our first story the trigger is going to be on tap or on click and then it's going to navigate to our story one and the animation is going to be set to dissolve ease in and out and a duration of 300 meter per seconds come to this second screen which is our first story link it to this place and then our trigger for this interaction is going to be after delay of remember 8000 meter per seconds which is equivalent to eight seconds it should be navigating to story two and i'm going to set it to 
smart animate of easing and out 300 meter per second select story 2 then i will link it set our trigger to after delay of 8000 meter per second smart animate easing and out i'm going to select the exit icon for all of them this this and this for the three stories i'm going to all link them to this one and then i'm going to set it to on click smart animate of easing and out 300 meter per seconds we're going to preview our interaction so this is the result of what we've done and everything is very smooth and you can see our insta story and the progress by indicator moving but i will need to bring down the progress bar a bit i'm going to head back to down a little more so it's the one two so i think this is okay i'm going to preview it in okay this is better now so it's moving and the videos are playing as you can see the progress bar indicator is moving and this was as a result of the three variants and the prototype we used so this is the result of our progress bar indicator we using three variants as you can see the video timing and the progress bar timing are equally the same so guys we've come to the end of this video and i hope that you really learned something today if you have questions any comments or concerns at all please do let me know in the comment section don't forget to like subscribe and thank you